Hello, I'm Ryan Spahn. I'm Michael Yuri, and, and this, this is the story, story of our, our first date. date. We first met at James Ginty's karaoke birthday party, and I had just moved to LA to start shooting Ugly Betty. We were both at his karaoke birthday party, sitting at a table, and, and I noticed Ryan from across the way. And you didn't notice me at all, <laughs> but I noticed him and afterwards asked James to introduce us. So yeah. James uh, agreed to do that, and so then we talked on the phone for like a half an hour, and we agreed to go on a date to see um, Cherry Jones in Doubt. She was touring to the Amundsen, I believe. And then... Don't you wish the rest of the date was about seeing Cherry Jones in Doubt? I saw it, but the but seat next I, to me was empty. I didn't make it to the show. <laughs> It took two years before we finally met up again. This is like a year later. I was in Hamlet with Brooke Bloom, and I was Horatio, and she said, oh my friend. I was audience member. And he was audience <laughs> member, and she said, oh my friend Ryan is here. I think you guys were supposed to go on a date once. And I was like, oh yeah, that guy, I remember. I'd love to meet him finally. And she said, he doesn't want to meet you. <laughs> so then cut to another year goes by, I've moved to New York because they moved the whole production of Ugly Betty to New York. Ryan moved to New York because he didn't want to live in LA anymore and he wanted to change. And so did Brooke. We're both in New York and we're hanging out. And she's like, guess who else just moved to New York? Brooke planned a night that I would hang out with her and he would hang out with her. Separately. Separately. But then he was late and I was early or vice versa. And we ended up overlapping. And so we both ended up at this bar and he's on the phone with somebody and he's like, yeah, I'm here to meet. And he looks up and sees me and he goes, <laughs> You. And we went in and we started to get to know each other for the first time in all those, in those, you know, two and a half years, we finally started to get to know each other. Prior to meeting him, dates would often be, there'd be something that felt awkward. Not necessarily awkward, but just like, I never felt exactly comfortable, relaxed in myself. And then when I met him, it was so easy. And so then, we went to the, this apartment down in the financial district and read this play. Didn't we play opposite each other? I don't remember. Did we play like, we good, like and played evil? Good, good and evil? That seems about right. <laughs> anyway, so we did that reading and hung out. And then afterwards, we all took the subway back uptown together. And Brooke was like, you guys, I got to go home and go to bed. And Ryan and I were like, well, you want to keep hanging out? And so we did. And then we hung out the next night, and the next night, and the next night, and the next night, and pretty much every night since. And that was yeah. 10 years ago. Pretty good, huh? <laughs>